Hey, it's Jason. I'm here to talk about Prop 19. First of all, who is it good for? People that are 55 or older or people that qualify as having a disability benefit from Prop 19. It's important to note that I'm not a tax preparer, so I cannot give you guys any tax or legal advice. Before you make any decisions like this, make sure that you run it by the appropriate professionals. A lot of people who benefit from Prop 19 are either retired or looking to retire soon. This proposition could be a great advantage for people who want to sell their home, but they're stuck because they can't afford the property taxes of a new home because home values went up. With Prop 19, basically people are allowed to sell their home and transfer their current taxes to another primary residence, a home that they actually live in, as long as the new home is of equal or lesser value. Beneficiaries, also known as people who inherit properties from their family, friends, or relatives, can also benefit from the tax breaks of Proposition 19. However, one detail is that they need to live in that home. It needs to be their primary residence or else they can't get the tax break. Unfortunately, this won't benefit people who inherit a home, say from their parents, and then that home is an investment property that they rent out because that's not their primary residence they're not living in. It's important to take note that victims of wildfire and other natural disasters will also be able to take advantage of Prop 19 as well. What do you think about Prop 19? What questions do you have? Please put that in the comments down below. Go ahead and click this playlist. It'll give you a little more information on the current housing market. Thank you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate you guys. See you next time.